The knowledge, techniques and time necessary to build an aircraft with this construction did not lend themselves to the kit market or the capability of amateur builders, who generally have not previously constructed aircraft. My family had considerable experience with aircraft constructed from wood, which was the primary technology used by my parents in their company. However, I did have some knowledge of composite construction from the development of the Robin ATL, developed in 1983. The idea came to me to use composite technology but with carbon fiber to enable the uncompromising objective of weight control used so successfully by Michel Colombon in the MC-100. This led to the development of the technology used throughout the MCR family of aircraft. Today, the aircraft is lighter than it was, and far lighter than anything else made in the aeronautical construction industry. Components previously made of steel and aluminium are now made of carbon, rudder pedals, control sticks, etc. Brake controls can be fitted to the rudder pedals or be hand-operated. All of the controls and control rods are now manufactured from carbon. With the exception of the rudder controls, the use of heavy cables has been avoided. The aircraft structure is formed from carbon together with the nose leg. Gradually, gram by gram, these modifications have enabled us to save over 20 kilos.